getting her done. Well, today is uh, May 7th, and Kaylee and I had a heck of a good morning. Well, we didn't starting out, but... <laughs> We got on this bird and he was gobbling. Man, he was hot. And uh, he came out to new seeding over here. I'm on hunting on Slava Farms. Came out to this new seeding and uh, had a bunch of hens come meet him out there. And at that point, I'm like, there's no way we're gonna be able to pull this bird away. And I started started doing all kinds of stuff, hitting him with a mouth call, slate call, scratching in the scratching in the uh, leaves and stuff. And I got him kind of interested and he came out of the field from the hens and he got to the edge of the woods and gobbled and gobbled and gobbled and I knew that you know he just kind of hung up this is a big old bird I mean three year old for sure he could be even more he's got over inch spurs real pointed he's got probably a 10 inch beard heck of a bird and uh, anyways he got to the edge of the woods and just gobbled 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 I couldn't do anything and I can I'm comfortable out to 55 yards with this gun I mean 60 I can do it but I don't like it but uh, so he was out there about 60 yards, just strutting back and forth, gobbling everything. And finally, I started getting wild with the calls and doing all kinds of stuff. And he got interested and just started gobbling and slowly worked his way in, strutting the whole way. And he got to about 45 yards. And uh, I was hiding behind this tree, and I heard him putt. And I'm like, oh no, it's now or never. So I swung out around the tree and I found him as he he started. He knew something was wrong at the end and started going like these old birds do and I put one into him and knocked him out. So I uh, had Kaylee here behind the camera with me, had my GoPro going, I don't know how good you're going to be able to see it, but this is a heck of a fun hunt, this, it'll be memorable. And then on top of that, while I was calling in this turkey, I looked next to me and here laid the shed. And what's kind of funny about this shed is the last day of, uh, of the crossbow season, I had this, this buck would come out of the corner of the field down here every night, right below me, and I'd watch him and whatnot, and he came out the same night I shot that big nine point out here with my crossbow on the last day of the season, so it's just a little shed, but it's kind of cool because I have, have some history with it, but uh, heck of an awesome hunt, couldn't be any happier with him, what do you think babe? That was exciting. Well, now it's Kaylee's turn back in New York. We'll have to see if we can go get on another one. <laughs>